Good. Welcome, guys. Hello from frosty Vienna. Um, currently, it's minus two degrees. Uh, pretty cold. Not like in Greenland, but yeah, we tried to, or I tried to get the same conditions. Uh, I have when I fly over the water. So if you see here, uh, if you come closer, we have actually also ice on the water. So if we go down with our feet here, you see it's pretty icy. Um, so yeah, temperature wise from the water, uh, it looks the same as in the water uh, in the Arctic Ocean. So that's why I thought, okay, let's give the the aviation suit a test um, this is an immersion suit from Viking um, we have that when we fly over the Atlantic uh, to prevent us from yeah getting wet when we get into the water and I've actually never tested it so today's the day we're gonna put this on and then yeah jump into the water and see how it feels uh, how it actually feels because I don't want to experience it the first time when it's the time to get in there. Yeah, um, one more thing. We don't have a lifeboat here. Uh, this is actually just a test for the suit. So normally if I would have to get into the water, I would uh, try or blow up the boat, the life raft and uh, try to get into the life raft. And then I would not be in the water anymore. But at least to see how it is in the water, we're gonna test that now. And before we jump in, I also wanna show you what's inside, what I'm gonna wear. So you actually have not seen uh, this suit on the channel until now. Um, I bought it, what was it, half a year ago and I've used it now for five crossings already. You have not seen a crossing with this suit already, so this is now a video before the crossings which are coming later with that suit. Um, we also have my mom here. <laughs> she she's here to protect me. Hi, lovely Mr. mom. Mama. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, and thank you, Eric, my brother, for filming. And hello, dad is also there. Yeah, whole family is here to watch that big happening. Okay, so what do we have in the immersion shoot suit? We have the suit itself. Looks like this. Pretty orange, right? Uh, should be uh, tight. Uh, should be. Uh, how do you say, waterproof, that nothing comes inside. Uh, yeah, this is the suit. And under the suit, I have this little, also a warm thing to, yeah, just stay warm underneath, comes with the suit. And when I jump in now, I'm gonna have the exact same clothes I have when I fly. So I wanna have this as close as possible to the real thing. So let's change and then, Let's get it. Okay. So, this is what I have uh, underneath the suit. This keeping warm thing, which also comes with it. And now we come to the suit itself, or himself, or whatever. Open it here. Then we're also gonna jump into uh, the arms. What I have down here is a HUD, which I'm actually gonna wear when I jump into the water. Just like this, right? And I also have uh, gloves in the arms for each for each hand. Now I'm in the suit and I close it all up and the, uh, the final test to see if it's really tight is to go down and if it blows up very good, then you know, okay, it's airtight and basically watertight. Um, I have some ventilation here in the back. Um, if you, can, you see it here, some ventilation. And if I go down here, then the air is coming out in the back. So yeah, that's a good sign, it's tight. And now uh, it's time to get into the water. As you see now, I already have one glove here because I got the GoPro on here. Uh, then on the other side, we have this glove, which we're gonna put on in a second. But also down here, we have the HUD, which I'm gonna put on now. Mm -hmm. 
so I don't hear much now but I think this is how it should be yeah to keep the head warm so now we take this glove and what's very interesting right now you see this is tight and I'm now putting the gloves over it so it's gonna be interesting how much water is getting into the hands this is the first of a part which I'm very interested about and to be on the safe side we're gonna take the, the life vest also so, Yeah, and now you, you can't forget, in the real deal, I have to do this on my own, right? Oh. oh, I'm floating. It's tight. I think it's tight. Okay. It's really tight. Okay, I'm starting to feel some some uh, water in the hands now. And you see here, it's ice. There is nothing. And it, it's not cold. It's really warm, really. It's not that bad. Leg? Huh? The leg? Yeah, kind of the feet are feeling wet. And a sort of, I don't know. But the suit is tight. The suit is, is, I mean, I haven't, I have to put my head under the water, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay, then let's go. Okay. That's also interesting. But yeah, so if, if the water comes into the hand, it, it's really cold. But the rest is, is actually, is actually, it's nice. Ah. So now I have water in my ear. Ooh. Oh. On the face, it's really cold. On the face, it's really, really cold. Oh, this kills me. The face is, is not nice. The face is not good. And this is also not good with the, with the gloves. So I think I'll have to change my gloves to warmer ones or to neoprene gloves. So we have 6 minutes 30, it's still very warm, uh, getting into the raft would be my next problem. So let's say 8, eight minutes, okay 8 minutes I sorted everything out, I'm okay. in the ocean fighting for my life um, and now it's time to, to get into the raft. Yeah, my hands are feeling very cold now, to be honest, they are not nice. We have been in, in the water now for 8 minutes, almost 9 minutes and everything is Body is still warm, hands are freaking cold. Plus, I think my, my face would be so so cold when, I, when when it's big waves and you get water into the face all the time. This would be crazy. Okay, let's try to get up here. Okay. Okay. Oh. Yeah? I'm, I'm, I'm dry. I'm really dry. We have to test it now inside to see if the suit is really dry. But yeah, we can take this away. But I really think the suit is dry. Like my clothes inside. I feel like a, like a plastic zipper bag when it's sucked up. 
um, yeah, big problem, fingers, really big problem. There, there was water getting inside, so we have to improve that. And uh, head, heart, uh, yeah, head is, head is, head is okay actually. Head is okay, but the, the face I think would be a big problem. But I was in the water now for, for nine minutes and it worked out. So I think if I manage to get into the boat by, uh, by well, let's say five minutes, it will be fine. Yeah, so let's get changed again into dry clothes and then we 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 see what's wet and what's still dry or if something is wet. So after that nice bath I had to warm up a bit and the final conclusion actually was the suit is totally tight. The only problem I have or yeah, the only problem I see is the fingers or the hands, they were getting really cold and the face as I told you before. So I already improved that and I hope that I never have to experience that in real life. I know this was a kind of a boring video, but maybe for some of you guys this was interesting to see. Um, as always, thank you for watching and I hope you're doing good and see you in the next one. Bye guys.